What is up everybody? It's Gorilla Man here back with another farming simulator video and I think everybody recognizes this map or most people recognize this map. This is the uh, map that I built the airport on as you guys can see. I've been meaning to do an update video on this or go through and put some more stuff in because I this video got a lot of views for me and everybody really liked it and I asked a bunch of people uh, what do you guys want me to add. So a bunch of people said add in like more planes, more helicopter landing. A bunch of open sheds, see if I can find some smaller planes, which I wasn't able to find any smaller planes yet, but maybe eventually. And then somebody else suggested getting a golf cart to tow around luggage in. I have one of those now. I have a trailer that I can throw on the golf cart to help us move luggage and a bunch of things. So I basically, I just want to get like a couple more buildings put down, do some more, uh, more with this guy here, because this guy lays down. If you guys didn't see this, this is the mod, this is the ground modification mod. It works with the lizard roller, and there's a few lizard rollers out there that people have modded so that the, the roller itself isn't super tiny like this one, and so it's like 15 times the length, so you can just do huge, huge fields all at once. Um, it's pretty helpful. It has like 15 or 16, somewhere in there, types of grounds that you can put down. Like this one's concrete. We got gravel here. Um, I think we have asphalt somewhere around here. Let me check inside here. I think this is gravel in here too. Yeah, gravel in here too. But I got this guy filling up, which he's probably almost done we're gonna lay down some more dirt too so I hope everybody enjoys what we're gonna do today and let's get started so first we are going to go purchase everything we need so we start with cars and we're gonna go down here to find it so where's this thing at Yamaha no let's try miscellaneous hey there it is all right so we got one here let's see which one's which Okay, so let's try this one first. I think this one might be the one. So main color, we're gonna go gray rims. Whew, rim color, rim color, rim color. Let's just go black and design color is gonna be blue. Purchase it. All right, we got that. Now we need the ATV trailer, which is somewhere around here. Let's go check cars again. I don't think I saw it in cars though. Maybe it's up here. Lambo mods. Nope. Caterpillar. No. Winston. No. Oh, we do have the demon in here, though. Is that the demon? No, that's the Hellcat. We got the Hellcat in here. That thing is a monster. If you guys have never seen that before, it is crazy fast. Uh, let's see. Miscellaneous. Let's recheck in here. It's not miscellaneous. So we have an ATV cart somewhere around here. Maybe it's in the low loaders, trailers, or dollies. Not those two, it's not that guy. Not there. Weights, nope. Let's check, trucks. No, we got the Peterbilt in there though. Oh, we have a lot of stuff in this. All right, looks like I can't find that. I'll find it in a minute, but that doesn't matter for now. We need to go check that, check that golf cart out. It's gonna take me a minute to scroll through everything because we have so much in here, it's absolutely insane. Okay. Oh, yeah, I forgot this was the map that I also tried to do the bailing challenge on, which I failed miserably at. We do have a lot of bales chilling there, though. All right, so let's go over here. Hop up on this. Oh, there it is. Okay. All right, that's not bad. That's pretty good, pretty good. Let's just stay on the top. Lambo Mods. Look at that. Oh, it's got light bar. Oh, that's pretty sick. And it's got a hitch on it, which is what we were wanting. All right, so let's see if we can go back in and find this thing. All right, so it doesn't look like I can find it, but we'll use this anyway. So we're going to take this over. Probably going to buy three or four more of these, actually. Probably all different colors, because we're going to need these to shuttle people in and out of the airport and back and forth, which means that we need to put down another building or a uh, little... Oh, whoa there. Whoa there. We need to put down another uh, open garage here. Which is what we probably should have put down in the first place to cover up all these cop cars because we don't want them exposed to the elements like they are. Oh, I'm going way past everything. Oh, yeah, and we also have those lights to put down. We need to put those lights down. We forgot to put those down last video, which was a huge mistake because we need those. Okay, we put down a utility building. Um, utility building can go back here because we don't need it, but we need something to run our utilities, obviously. No shacks needed in here. Uh, small vehicle shelters. There we go. All right, so let's go. Few. Let's go one there. Line this one up pretty good. One there. We'll put another one here. 
If I can actually line these up perfect, it can make it look like there is actually just one long vehicle shelter here, which is pretty good actually. So we're gonna stack these guys in here. So we're gonna go purchase a few more. I'm not sure how many more, but a few more. I don't know how this thing will do in the dirt. Probably should have, <laughs> probably should have put something down other than dirt right here for these poor golf carts. Especially if it rains, these things are not getting out of this spot. Let's go miscellaneous. Another cart, we'll buy just the regular one that already comes with all the colors. We'll buy a red one, this, that looks good to me. And then we'll also pick up a green one. There we go. Oh, 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 look at that, look at that. Oh, wow, look how colorful all these are. These are actually super colorful, I like it. All right, so we're gonna take this. Oh, oh, we got a, we got a Skype message popping up on us. All right, let's go through here. We're gonna stack this guy over here next to this other one. I think I might leave one out towards the end though. Um, something for us to use. Apparently this thing can go 217 miles an hour right now. As you guys can see in the bottom right, if you can see that, um, maybe you can't see if you're watching on a phone, but these things apparently can go 217 miles an hour. Uh, that is what the cruise control says it can be set to, which is usually what the speed actually can be set to, which is insanely fast for a golf cart, obviously. Uh, we also need to work on a driveway driving up to there because we need uh, we need something else because we have nothing leading us in there. We're backing this up. Oh, we need to add a good beep beep sound to this. Last one. Oh, got the lime green with the orange top on it. I like it, looking pretty good. We also need to move our Volvo and go stack some more dirt up in the berm just in case the plane manages to not take off. It doesn't go sailing, um, like however many hundred feet it probably would go sailing. We need to throw more dirt in that berm there because, well, quite frankly, we don't want them to be all, to get all totaled and uh, wrecked up, which probably would happen anyways, but you know, just gotta take extra precautions. Oh, what happened to the dump truck? Dump truck not working now? Oh, we gotta turn this guy on, don't we? Um, unload. Pop in the little guy. Oh, there we go. We just had to hop in it. Okay, so now it's gonna take forever to fill back up. We'll see if it starts. There we go. It's dumping now. All right, that's good. That's what we wanted to see is the dumping. Okay, so we're gonna hop back in this guy, and we are gonna be laying down some grass. So let's lay down. Let's see ground type. Okay, let's go see what the meadow does. So we are going to go grass right here. Okay, so what do we got? We got meadow, lawn, bright dirt, <laughs> bright dirt, original ground, uh, grass field. Let's go grass field. This is probably more of a grass field type of area. So we're going to cover not all of this area because that's obviously a lot of area for just me to go over with just this tiny little roller But we're gonna cover quite a bit of this area in this grass because I'm kind of tired of it It obviously it just looks like a regular field that somebody just took in Threw a bunch of like things in which is <laughs> kind of what we did, but uh, Needless to say let's go through and let's just plow all this stuff or uh, Use the ground modification and re take it back up so we're just gonna be laying some grass down because and we're gonna lay some down in front of the uh, traffic control tower too because we want that to look all nice and fancy. And then once we finish this, we will go out to the front gate and we will fill in that with a nice little pathway straight in. Um, I don't like how it looks right now because it doesn't have anything, which is kind of annoying to me and I wanna have a little driveway leading up. All right, there's that. And then we can just back it up, roll it back down and then we'll go to the traffic control and then we'll go out front. I can just drop it. Yep. That's done rolling. Pick it back up. Roll on over. All right. So right here in this little area right here is where I want to add a little bit of grass. I should probably... I've went from the other way, but it's fine. And we'll go to about right there. Then we'll back it up. Start laying some right here. I think this mod is so funny how you can just take any ground type you got and you can just automatically switch it over to one of like 15 different ground types i really like this mod it's top it's up there for my top uh favorite mods mainly because the fact of it had so much more potential for creating maps or like creating obstacles or creating airports i mean you can do a lot with it which is why i really 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 like it 
That propeller is still spinning on that plane. I did not realize that. All right. So we got a couple more passes right here. Line this one up good. And I think you can even lay down plow dirt too. So if you really wanted to, you could technically use this as a plow. Definitely not recommended to use this as a plow, but I'm just saying that you could if you really wanted to. Okay, we'll cut that right there. Then we'll finish this spot right here. We'll run two quick strips to meet up with that helipad right there. And then we're gonna head it out to the front really quick and we're gonna lay down a quick driveway. I think I'm gonna lay down asphalt or make it kind of blend from the road. I'm not sure if the road was asphalt or if it's concrete. I feel like it might be pavement, like concrete. Um, we'll find out though. All right, backing it up. Going through. All right, dropping it down. Oh, this is looking good. I like this. This is a grass field lay down. It's not a meadow. Meadow's a little bit brighter, um, but I like the grass feel of this one. I really wish I would have laid the grass down right there before I set those golf carts there, but it's okay. All right, so we got a little green in here, which is good. Uh, all right, so now right here for the front. Uh, ground type. Let's check and see. What was that? Pine needles? Bright dirt, original ground, cultivated, plowed, sowed. Okay, let's just go asphalt for now. Oh, oh yeah. I was like, <laughs> what are we getting hit on? I forgot how wide this thing is. Can we even get this out now? Oh, crap. Oh, no. This is not good. We might have to sell this. See if we can... Uh... Yeah, this is bad. All right. Uh, that's what I get for trying to do double wide. Hey, maybe we got it. No, there's no way. All right, let's drop that. We're, we're going we're gonna to take a quick L and we're going to go sell this guy. Let's sell it, yes. Shop. So we're going to go back over by another tractor because we got to. Um, can we find that one? Massey. Let's do narrow. Okay, standard. We gotta do standard. Crank up the power. Alright, there we go. We got a new one. Now we gotta switch through everything to get to it. Boom, there we go. Alright, so this one looks a little bit better. We should be able to fit through our entranceway with this. That's pretty sad though that we couldn't fit through our entranceway. And actually looking at this now, I think I'm going to lay down, oh, I think I'm going to lay down uh, concrete, definitely. Oh, uh, I wish you could lay down road markers, too. That I think that would look pretty good if you could get road markers in there. All right. Thank you. And then change road type to, oh, concrete already went over. Got to go back through it. Cloud sewed. There we go. All right. And then drop her down. So it'll change because this is different than what we got out there right now. I don't even know if, how far it'll go out. Okay, so it goes out to the road, but it doesn't cover up the road, which is good. All right, let's back it up. It doesn't quite match the color that we were shooting for, but it is better than dirt. <laughs> for sure. For sure better than dirt. All right, then we're going to see if we can back up to bring it all the way up to the uh, pillar we got right here. Right, drop her down. I wonder if you can back up to do it. Oh, you can. Okay, that's pretty good actually. All right, so then we will take a wide. We'll run one on down the middle, then one on each side of there. Maybe some gravel on each side actually, make it look a little bit more, a little bit more like it actually would in real life. Because usually when you have concrete, you'll have gravel on either side, especially if you don't have the curb there, which we. Don't have a curb. I'll right, we'll back her up. All right, now let's lay down some gravel. Let's go pine needles, grass, gravel. Oh, we were there. Look for pine needles. And there. All right, we got gravel good. Let's lay down a little bit of gravel. We got to stop and do that again. All right. I should probably just back the other edge in since I know what's going to happen. Oh, I like it a lot. It's coming together. Oh, this is looking really good now. 
All we gotta do is now is we gotta get some lights up. We gotta get some more vehicle shelters put up down the uh, the range a little bit. There we go. We got that picked up. And then I think we're gonna use this and lay down some grass where we lay down the vehicle ranges. Maybe. I think we might. All right. So we are right here. So we need to throw in some lights first. Because we can't operate this place at nighttime without some lights. So we're gonna go some big lights. We gotta throw big lights obviously going down right there. So we're gonna lay down a few right here. And then we're gonna flip them over and we're gonna lay down a few more facing the other way just so you can see everything you're doing. And then we'll throw some more down at the very end of the runway uh, just so people can see where they're going and nothing happens. Let's throw some down on, oh, going a little crazy. Throw some down on these guys. Give them some spotlight. Crank these over. Get this big military Russian helicopter. This huge chopper over here. We'll give them some light. Because what I want to do is I want to kick this to nighttime and maybe see what it looks like with all these lights up, which I'm hoping you can see everything. Um, we'll definitely light up the entrance just in case anything crazy goes on. Boom. And then we'll lay one out right here because technically there shouldn't be a this won't be a walkway anymore because it's not a field obviously so nobody should be coming through here nobody ever was in the first place which is good all right lay that down we'll give them um, one right here then let's go all the way down to the end here where we got our berm and then we'll lay oh how do they do these okay let's lay them um, like this so they're not hitting they don't hit the uh they don't hit the pilot in the face. We don't want them to get blinded in, in the eyes. We want them to see that the light's shining right here and that there's obviously stuff. Okay, keep laying these down. Oh, crap. Okay. That didn't go too well. Okay, maybe we can go in and sell it pretty easily. All right, flip it over. There we go. We got some more to lay down. So yeah, don't try and move your uh, cursor around or your WASD keys when you're placing things because <laughs> you get one placed in the middle there. All right, let's go garage. Oh, wow, we got a lot of stuff in here. Um, these, sell. Okay, I think we get to choose. Yes, okay, that's what we wanted here. Sell that guy. Yes, thank you. All right, that worked pretty good. So now let's kick over to the Volvo, which looked full to me. Yep. He is full. All right, so we're going to take him all the way down and around, and we're going to lay down some more dirt. Uh, this time, I'm not going to lay it down across, because when I laid it down across last time and we drove over it, it flattened down because this is the Add Dirt mod, and you can flatten it down pretty easily, uh, especially if you have a roller. So let's just go over here, and we're just going to lay down one big pile in the center until it stops, and then we're going to move over a little bit, and we're going to lay down some more. I should probably cap this area off with some barbed wire too soon. All right. All right, there we go. That's a good spot. So you see how it kind of stops us there? It's like, all right, well, you've put in a, quite a few there. So let's put some more in the middle here to make the... Oh, one last turn right there. Make the middle a little bit more taller because that's the area that we want really tall. All right. Now let's see if we can... Back up a little bit more. Ah, there we go. We're getting a nice tall mound now. Oh, dang. It's just going to go. Just going to let it all go now. All right, I think we can stop at that. That one's not really doing much more. All right, there we go. Then let's do some more on that left side there that we're looking at. Back her up. Come on. There we go. And we'll just finish it out right there. That's all the dirt that'll take. Oh, is this still going to be dumping? Oh, got to manually turn it back down. I did have another add dirt spot there, but I just don't have it activated right now. All right, now let's go to placeables. And then we need to place down a few more garages uh, to store stuff on the sides. Because obviously later on, we're going we're gonna to acquire more... Acquire more... Uh, let's go with the vehicle shelters. Uh, more planes, more everything, pretty much. So let's go vehicle shelters. Let's go them right here. Let's line this sucker up. There's one there. 
Then the land does change a little bit, so it gets a little uh, wonky along the edge there. All right, so we got two more vehicle shelters laid down. Uh, we'll lay one this way because I... Uh, wait, can this even fit? Yeah, it'll fit. All right, got one more laid right there. And then, what else? We already have that laid down. I know we have one of those. Uh, let's go another helipad. We could use another heli shelter. That's what they call them in this. Uh, we'll lay it right here. So this will be over here way off to the side. Probably not going to be used too often. Um, just lay two down just to fill up the space. All right. Where is... Cycle through everything. All right. So what we got here is... So now we, we got this thing fully completed. We're going to take a quick, quick tour through on the new golf carts. So we're coming in here, coming into the... Uh, the little private airport here. Obviously, you can tell it's an airport. It's got security and everything. You got these gates. Obviously, somebody would be manning the gates to open them for you. They wouldn't be open for all the time. So you roll on through here. We got a concierge service. Pick you up. Take you over on our colorful golf carts. Take you over here. You exchange all your info, all your luggage, and all that. And then we hop you back on. I would have a luggage cart. We'd throw all the luggage in the cart. We'd roll around. We'd pull up right here along the edge. And then we go, and then we take all your luggage, you hop in the plane. Oh, not in the golf cart. You hop in the plane, and we would take off, and we would see you never again. And then we'd take all your luggage. No, we'd throw it on the plane with you. But that's pretty much it, guys. I added a little bit, uh, filled out the airport a little bit more, which is what I really wanted to do. Added in some golf carts, made it a little bit more personable to help people out. Um, can even, we can even run this place 24-7, because we got night uh, lights now. We got light bars on our golf carts so we can see where we're driving, which is pretty awesome. Um, but anyways, guys, thank you all for watching. If you guys like this video, hit that like button. You guys got any more suggestions for things like this you guys want me to do? Leave a comment down below and let me know. But in that, I'll see everybody in the next video.